Hello guys, it's Sublimity and I'm bringing you another raft building tip video. So today I'm going to be talking about um, a building feature that allows you to place platforms in uh, the air without using the um, poles, um, the wooden pillars. So what I want to show first is an example using the floating um, platforms. Now to make this, you just need to use triangle uh, wooden triangle floors. And to get those down first, you need the half wooden pillars. So just place a wooden pillar, and then you can place down a triangle floor. Now, it's only the triangle floor that'll stay up, not the full blocks. However, you can hold the full blocks if you connect them to another triangle floor. So you can get rid of that, and it'll work like that. Um, so yeah, if I was to get rid of this, it'd get rid of the other piece. This example here pretty much just shows how you could just have, in a survival world, the nets on the base floor, and then you could, um, so if you were to place foundation to begin with, put your pillars down, then you could place um, your triangle wooden floors afterwards, and then you can get rid of that. So, what I usually use the floating trick for is when I want to make a roof that hangs off the edge of a building. Now, this is kind of an illusion trick because obviously there's a triangle piece below it, but you would hardly ever see that. I mean, if you really wanted to as well, you could just have another wood piece, for example, and then flip it around so you've got a full block if you wanted to make it look a bit neater, but it's not necessary and it hides it a bit better if you don't have it. So yeah, you could use this, for example, if you wanted a um, if you wanted anything hanging off of a building, you because know, usually you can't have a you can't have this um, come off so far. Usually, maybe like one block overhang, but you can have like you can do some pretty cool stuff. Okay, so in this second um, design that I've made, I just want to show how you can use the wooden triangle floors to make some quite interesting paint patterns. Um, yeah, so you can see here I've used like full blocks and triangle blocks and a mix match shit like that. Um, I've also kept the wooden pillars in corners and I think it makes the design look a bit better sometimes when you have something physical holding it down because, you know, it's, it seems more realistic. This next design that I'm showing is just a quick example of how you can make a one tile wide spiral staircase. So all I've done for this is use the triangle wooden floors and I've rotated them 90 degrees every time it goes up level. Um, you can have this floating, or you could even have this connected inside somewhere, but it's just a really cool, you know, design showing that you can make loads of interesting geometric patterns using the floating foundation. Okay, so this last example, I pretty much just want to show how you can have the radar on the second level. You could really use this on um, a survival world if you want to save on wood, or if you want to keep your raft really open. I mean, this could also be used as a, like an agility course almost, you know. It's quite crazy what, what we can do now. Um, but yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing what people make. Uh, yeah, I, uh, I hope you guys found this uh, helpful and I'll uh, try and find more mechanics and tricks soon. So yeah, thanks. All right, bye.